Welcome back, guys, for more City State 2. I think um, something that's getting to a lot of players, and it was getting to me, was how the hell do you get advanced manufacturing? Like, how do you make it happen? Now, in the last episode, I was, um, I was kind of trying to figure it out. You have to raise land value. Um, and I did that. I just didn't do it quite right. The problem with advanced manufacturing, let's get away from there. Uh, the problem with advanced manufacturing is it hates basic manufacturing. So trying to get advanced manufacturing going near basic manufacturing is very difficult. However, if you actually look here, I did get some advanced manufacturing here. Okay. And you'll see that um, there's the land value and then there's the desired land value. So that's the minimum land value that you have to get to in order to get advanced manufacturing okay if you look over here the land values over here are very 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 low and it's because of the basic manufacturing and the pollution so this is what i recommend you do first thing you have to make sure that you get rid of the any demand for basic manufacturing so i'm going to come up here and then i'm going to throw in some medium density industry just to soak up any demand, let's let that run on fast for a bit. Uh, in order to uh, encourage things a little bit, I'm going to go down to the airport. We need uh, we need more capacity at the airport, so let's upgrade you. What? Okay, we've got we've got. I'm going to upgrade it again. Actually, make sure we've got loads and loads of capacity. Okay, excellent. Right, let's go back up here. Okay, so we're soaking up the demand for basic manufacturing. I'm going to put, I'm actually going to put in some more, some more room, but this is just to soak up all of that demand. Okay, fine. It's gone minus. Good. Now we're going to come down here. I have set up um, just a, a few roads and I have put in some parks to help increase the land value. Now let's have a look at the, the land value in this area. So if we come over here, this is uh, well, like around 150. And if we look at these, what was the desired? The desired was like 128 okay so this is already like a, a good value land then i've put in some parks and if we look at the the land value here the land value here is over a thousand so this is this is good high quality land very desirable what i'm now going to do is go over here and i'm going to show you that uh, it doesn't matter what type you put in we're going to put in uh, we'll put light in this section We'll put in some medium over in this section. Boom, 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 boom. And I'm going to put some dents in down here. Now, I've got demand for advanced manufacturing up the wazoo. So what you want to do, start it. Just keep an eye out on the first few buildings that spawn and make sure that you're getting advanced manufacturing. Yes, yes. Because what you can get, like at the beginning, it's very easy for some basic manufacturing to spawn in. If that happens, just demolish it and replace it. But that is advanced manufacturing. That's advanced manufacturing. Now down here in the dents, we've got advanced manufacturing going on. Let's crank it up. There you go. And the demand for basic manufacturing is actually going to start to go negative. Excellent. Okay, looking good. Yeah, that is really nice. That is really nice. So let's have a look at advanced manufacturing. Advanced manufacturing. It's all advanced manufacturing. And I'm just going to throw in, I think I'm just going to throw in high density because there's, there's obviously massive demand for industry. So throw you across there and there and across there. But okay. What's the land value up here? Yeah, land value up here, about 152. It is possible for um, advanced manufacturing to get in here, but they won't like it because they're near basic manufacturing. So they'll probably move out. So how are we doing? Looks like we're getting rid of most of it. See, look, our advance is dropping because some of it is going in over here. Yeah, we get, we're getting a, a bunch of advance going in over here. 
but I won't like it because they're, they're too close to the basic. But yeah, look, a lot of this is advanced. In fact, advanced manufacturing has started to dominate this area. Yeah, a whole bunch of this is advanced as well. So, <laughs> there you go. That's how you get advanced. Just zone in large areas and make sure that the land value is um, above what they desire. And you've got it. And wow. We're up to 9,000 a month now. We've got half a million in the bank and things are flying. We've got our Department of Social Affairs. We can start throwing that in. So let's see. Have a look at our land value. It's um, It's been growing kind of nicely. In it goes. That's kind of a nice building. I like that. Okay, in you go. Right, so that allows us to do our social policies. So if we go into legislation and we go to society and we go, what, freedom of religion, state religion taught in school, state religion persecution of other flats, no. Secular state, state religion taught in schools. What does that give? Makes people more religious. Approval from the right. See, this is so tied into American politics. I don't like this particularly, but hey. Um, secular state. Like, serious? Who, who the hell is making this guy? So, okay, what? I'm not going to get into the politics of it, but it's kind of crazy. This is very left wing biased. Um, yeah. Well, yeah, we're, we're doing that. It's ridiculous. Okay, whatever. Uh, gender equality. Non-awareness program in schools. Enforce income equality in corporations. Positive discrimination. Okay, well, let's do... Enforce income equality in corporations. Okay, enact. And then gambling. Bank of Sino is allowed sports betting. Uh, we'll just say... I think we'll just go with license required. Okay, fine. And then human cloning. Allow cloning and genomics. Allow genomics, ban cloning. Allowed for research purposes only. And ban by well. Uh, you, we definitely want genomics. We, we don't want cloning. So it's either that one or that one. Allowed for research purposes only, I'd be kind of okay with. Um, that has a bad impact on the social land. So banning cloning stops people from moving up in class. Really? How? Like, how the hell does... Explain to me how that works. Um, advanced manufacturing benefits from it. I'm almost tempted to uh, to go with that. So if we ban cloning... So if we allow cloning for research purposes, that's worse for advanced manufacturing? Ha! Okay, that doesn't make any freaking sense whatsoever. Okay, you know, I'm going to... Oh, that, how does that impact the social ladder? All right, I'll go with that one. <laughs> These policies are silly. Unlike freedoms, let websites make their own rules. Uh, Pop-up spam to inform about privacy. All websites must guarantee free speech. Guarantee free speech. Prohibit, uh, prohibit usernames and an anonymity. Oh, wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> That'd be so nice. Let's do... I don't know. Let's do, let's do that. That's probably the current state of play in the world, isn't it? There you go. Uh, international adoptions. Um, I don't know. That's a, that increases the birth rate significantly. Yeah, we'll probably go with that. Yeah, we're going to go. And gun control. Oh, because this isn't at all <laughs> controversial. Uh, no restrictions. It's the wild, wild west. Restrict semi-automatic rifles and handguns. Sale and possession require selective licenses. Uh, prohibited. So this is what it is in the UK. And then this is what it is, I don't know. Um, I guess some states in the US are like this and some states are like this, aren't they? So it's kind of between these two. You know what? That gives, that gives a plus to the police. So... But that gives a bit of civil rights. Oh, it, is, oh, it also gives a boost to retail. <laughs> oh, go on. Maybe we'll do that then. Yeah, go on. So, no semi-automatic rifles. Yeah, go on. Do that. Okay, so we've got all of those done. Hooray. Now, I tell you what. We should actually look at the legislation for... The, have we got extra stuff yet? Um, no. 
No, it's fine. Um, government. No, no, it's all good. It's all good. So, what has that done? Oh my god, we are flying. How are things down at the airport? Let's have a look. So, um, we've got... We're about 50% capacity, so that's great. A new protest is happening. 75 left-wing citizens have gathered in... It's, you notice it's always the left-wing citizens who are gathering in the streets to protest. And yet, the policies that I've acted, enacted are probably just slightly leaning towards the left. Water production is insufficient. Okay, well, that's a, that's a legitimate issue. Have we got all the pumps running? No, we haven't. Let's turn on the other two pumps. There you go. There we go. That's good. How are we doing power-wise? Power-wise, we're at 93%. Time to throw in another coal power plant, I think. Yep. So what do we want? We want power. Power's that one, you idiot. Um, coal power plant. How much, like, how much is it for a nuclear power plant? Go away. Uh, nuclear power plant, 95,000. We can actually afford a nuclear power plant. How much do I want a nuclear power plant? What's the what's the power? Um, capacity, 8,000 compared to coal is 4,000. So it's only twice as good. But you know what? It's twice as good and it's less polluting. So yeah, I think we're probably going to go with that. I might pop that. Can I, the thing is I can't get more than one in there is the problem. You know what? Let's... Um, Let's put the nuclear power plant up here next to these factories. That's perfectly safe, isn't it? Yeah, it's fine. Why would anybody complain about that? Generators use. So we're producing 71%. I think maybe let's crank it up. You know what? Let's crank it up all the way. And I'm going to get rid of my coal power plants. Oh, yeah, I am. So they've gone. Now, what does that do to us power-wise? Let's have a look. We are using... 50% of our power, which is kind of perfect. All right. It's obviously pretty darn expensive, though. Monthly... Wow! Monthly cost, 11580 Holy hell! What was the monthly cost on the coal... I put the coal power plants back in, quick! Okay, that is insane. If I, What if I drop that down? Okay, that's 9000 Um... So, now we're at 95%, but we're making like six grand a month. Okay, wow, that is freaking expensive. That's crazy, crazy expensive. Seriously, what's what's the... So that's capacity... Oh, okay, that's 2,700 a month. So it's double... It's more expensive, though. Wow, nuclear is more expensive, which it should be, but it's cleaner, so that's good. Uh, not that anybody will care. They're all carry on protesting. Uh, nah, don't intervene. Let them go on with it. Now, uh, we've got crowded classrooms. We need more schools, I guess. Uh, let's have a look at our approval. Okay, our approval is not good. Um, approval from the, the right are really upset about our tax rates. But I kind of need the tax rates that I've got at the moment. Oh, well, the left are upset about tax rates as well. Well, I can't drop the taxes, like, that much. I mean, the only thing I can do is try and grow and then drop the tax rates. So, yeah. Our tax rates are not that outrageous. I mean, I don't think they're outrageous. Let's have a look. What are we at? We're, um, yeah, I did bump them up a bit. You know what? Let's drop it down a little bit. Uh, 17, 19, 22, maybe. Let's try that. And then retail... I'm leaving retail at three and a half. We can... Offices. No, I'm going to leave offices at seven. Basic manufacturing, maybe drop down to five. And we'll see how they react to that. Now, I've got property tax at one and a half percent. Yeah. I, no, I'm not going to drop it any further. We'll leave it at that. The long and the short of it is I've got uh, 700, almost 750K in the bank. We're making money. I've switched to nuclear power. Which, um, oh, we're actually, we're not, we haven't got enough. So let's bump that up to another generator. What does that give me? Come on. Okay, so we're now running at like 80%. We're, but we're making like 5,000. So that's kind of sort of good. That's good. I need to get onto, oh, good Lord. Crime is rampant. I need to get onto things like crime and the fire brigade and um, schools. I obviously need to uh, increase capacity.
like probably quite significantly um i i don't know like what do i do do i try and get more people in or or what look at this we've got we've got tower blocks you know what let's have a look over here so we've got now the land value isn't great but we're at stage six of seven and if we look at these buildings over here okay that's three that's three of six that's a road let's try this one that's three of six three of six three of six yeah they're all three of six so the land value is 223 and they desire a land value of 512 so we just need to make this place like a hell of a lot more attractive okay fine let's do that uh i think we can do this like relatively easy so let's get the old let's whip the old bulldozer out and i'm going to put in some parks large plazas i like the large plazas so let's go a couple of large plazas all over the place boom 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 okay and maybe do maybe we do the same down here so let's get rid of you rid of you I mean, at the moment, I'm not trying to make it that pretty. I'm just trying to kind of figure out the mechanics of the game because it's um, it's not easy. It is definitely not easy to like make a profit and stuff. Shut up, protesters. Okay, so having thrown those in, now what's the land value? Okay, land value 444. Uh, let's see. And value 394, 322. What about over here? What about like over here. 444, 267. Okay, that is 612. So that's much better. That's 582. Okay, cool. That's at three of four. Is land value going to kind of continue? Okay, that's 647. 547 looks like land value is headed up we could do we could do some more on that front let's have a look let's have a look at the actual land value yeah so you can see where i've put those parks in it has raised the land values and the places look much much better now all right let's have a look at those land values now then so How's it going? Land value, 326. Where did I put that? Where did I put that plaza in? So only 213, really? What about down? What about these down here? Oh, here you go. This is better. 982. 792. Oh, that's over a thousand. Oh, and look, we're getting skyscrapers. Offices, stage four. Oh yeah. That's that's only three or four. That's a big bit. No, hang on. If I point in the right. Okay, that's office. Stage four of six. Oh, we are starting to grow our city. We've got big apartment blocks. We've got big skyscrapers. Oh, I'm liking it. Look at all the development that's going on. And we're still making money, which is great. You know, what? I'm going to crank it up then. I'm going to crank it up and see what happens. Because usually what happens when you do that is that the whole thing goes to hell in a handbasket really quickly. So we are we are growing. We're up to 88,000 people. 89. The, um, the left wing is the protesting again. Well, that's a shocker. Um, and we're up to 89 protests now. 89 protesters, I should say. We are up at 8,000 a month. We're coming up on having a million in the bank. Okay. I can maybe start thinking about trying to make the place kind of look nicer. Uh, and not just, not just like putting in these grids where I've been trying to get like grow population and stuff. But I, haven't, I don't know have more kind of stuff like this and whatever. We, but I, this would, this should have been low density. This really should have been low density. Another protest. They want better health care. Okay, fine. And we need to do something about crime. Fine. 
Where's, where the hell did I put the PlayStation? Anybody remember where I put the PlayStation? Is, that's the hospital. How's the hospital doing? Well, the hospital needs to be upgraded for a start. Well, no, we can't upgrade it. Uh, we need another hospital. You know what? Didn't I put another? Yeah, I put another hospital there. Upgrade that. Ooh, we're still over the top. So I need another hospital. Let's put another hospital in maybe over here. That'll do. What do I want? I want a hospital. Where's the hospital? Public services and hospital. Hospital next to the fire station. That's a good plan. And we will upgrade you. All right, let's upgrade you all the way. Okay, so hospital's looking good. Fire station. Oh, we've just gone over capacity. Um, yeah. Um, did I upgrade all of them is the question. I need to go to my fire overlay. Which one's that? Security, that's health, traffic, pollution. You know what? Let's have a look at the pollution. How bad is the pollution? I bet it was a hell of a lot worse over here when I had those coal plants in. Anyway, what am I doing? Um, trying to get... Well, let's get... Why can't I find fire? That's traffic. That's sense of security. So that's going to be the police stations. Oh, it's, it's both. It's police stations and it's fire. So that's our police station. Okay, yeah, we're we are way way down on our policing. We're half what it should be. Let's put another police station in over there, and we will upgrade it. That gets us just under capacity. So let's put in another one to actually. You know what? I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it next to the hospital. There we go, and we'll upgrade that one. So now we're well within capacity. Got a little bit of room to grow. Uh, fire. So we still want sense of security, don't we? Yes. Yeah. So that is the fire station. Um, we're just about okay, actually. On fire. That's on fire. Um, we got the fire station there. I am thinking we should put another. I'm going to put another one in, say down here or something. Yeah, go on. We'll put a fire station in. Just about there. Okay. And we'll upgrade it. Right, we're well within capacity now. So, schools. Schools is going to be the next thing. Education. Okay. Education. Education is awful. How did education get so bad? Let's have a look. Oh, wow. Boy, are we over capacity. Holy boy, you need a lot of schools. Even the high schools are way over capacity. Jeez. Okay. So what's this? This is uh, that's an elementary school. We'll bang another one in. I don't know there. There you go. Another elementary school. Double upgrade. Oh, we're we're close. My God, how many elementary schools do you need? The answer is freaking loads of them. Right, freaking elementary schools. What are we going to do about elementary schools? Um, kill me, elementary schools. Boom, and another one. So that's another two going in. Boom, boom. And you lot. Boom, boom. Holy. Right, we are now in capacity for kids, which hopefully should stop the protests. Would be nice. But how's our cash situation going to react? And I can't see it being that good at the moment. Having done all of that, has that improved our approval ratings? No, not in the freaking slightest. <laughs> How? Like, I don't know. I suppose this is based more around the policies. They hate the tax rates. Um, and yet, like, I can barely make money as things stand. How would I make money if I dropped the tax rates? Uh, our cash does seem to be heading back in the right direction which is kind of nice but yeah we've we're starting to get some demand again which is good so yeah do i put do i put some i suppose i put some more uh, put some more housing in over there like that cool okay we're getting demand like across the board which is super awesome let's do let me do let's do a nice a nice nice tree lined street coming up to 
there. And we'll put some more uh, some more low density in. You know what? Let's, let's have this street join up to this as well. And we could do some we could do some little side streets, couldn't we? Um yeah, especially if I do it like that kind of thing. We'll just we'll just keep putting in some low density housing around these areas. And see if getting some additional people in here can get us back into a profit situation. Wouldn't that be nice? We'll see. Uh, I don't know how much, I don't know how enthusiastic I, I am about our ability to, uh, to get back into profit. We'll see. I mean, this is just throwing a little bit of low density in. How much difference is that gonna make? Okay, we are minus, a, okay, well, well, we're under minus a thousand now, so that's kind of good. How does it look now? I gotta say, it does like from the air. It does look quite good. Okay, we got power outages, so now I've got more. Got, got to put more power in. But look, we're are we gonna hit positive? Now, now what power do I? Oh, you know what? I can, I can just turn on an extra generator. There you go. But boom, <laughs> another minus two thousand. Holy, it is. It is not easy to balance the books in this game. Uh, these protests just get worse and worse and worse. Okay. Um, the central... We can build the central bank, but, you know, we'll do that another... Crime is rampant. Really? Why is crime rampant? Crime shouldn't be rampant. I don't think crime is rampant, because I... Didn't I beef up the police station? Um, that, that's the police station. Yeah, we should be fine. There's no reason. No reason that should be bad. Oh, well. You know what? More price. Really? How? How do you keep them happy, guys? Like, seriously, how do you keep them happy? And, like, we were doing so well. And then suddenly it's taken a downturn. It is that kind of game. You go up, you go down, you go round and around. All right, well, we're going to leave it there for now. And, um, yeah, let me know what you think. Leave me your comments and I'll catch you for the next one. Peace out.